Um, I'm Steve Inns. I'm a, um, a writer and game designer. I've been in the industry for 18 years and uh, did a few various um, odd, odd jobs before that. <laughs> but um, I started in the industry as a, an artist, moved into a producer role, and then um, sort of like fell into design and writing really, and, um, and never really looked back. And about seven years ago, I, I turned freelance and have worked for a number of um, clients, including the wonderful Wizard Box, who obviously are the developers behind um, both uh, the Captain Morgan game and the Soblon game that came before it. Uh, and that's about my career. <laughs> She's obviously a very um, attractive looking character on screen, um, but um, Morgan is, is is a strange character in the sense that she likes to think she's very tough and hard-hearted, but, but really she's quite a softy in, in many respects. I mean, she, she won't take any nonsense, but, but certainly you know, the, the characters that she has to put up with show that she's, um, she's quite um, um, you know, sort of like easygoing in, in many respects. We, we, do, we do have a little um, nod here and there to, to So Blonde, even though So Blonde is set much further in the future, um, and you know, sort of the, the, the characters here will not know of, of the characters, you know, of Sunny Blonde. But um, there, there are a few nods, and you know, sort of, we have fun. It is a comedy game, and um, we don't we don't worry about being necessarily historically accurate or anything like that, because because we set out to have fun. It's it's a fun pirate game. It's not you know dark. You know, menacing or anything like that. It's you know, so 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 there are there's plenty for the so blonde people to enjoy. There's plenty for for people who have previously enjoyed um, you know the fun style of adventure in the past. So yeah, I mean it's just it's just a great game. I think, I hope, <laughs> but obviously I'm biased. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, Spin-offs are happening all the time, and it would be good to do do something like this. Um, so, so who knows, you know, but uh, at the moment there are no specific plans. The, the, the beauty of, of Wizard Box is that they've, they've got some very talented guys, um, some very, um, and, and, and it's just a pleasure to work with them because they're very responsive. We, we, we kind of like pass information back and forth all the time. And, and they try and accommodate all my um, craziness as much as possible. And, um, but I'm very, you know, sort of realistic about not everything can can um, can be done, and so so we reach some um, perfectly good compromises on occasion. But most of the time, they're they're very good with me, and uh, and I'm very appreciative of that. Well, they didn't beat me very often, so you know that that's a that's a positive thing, isn't it? But uh, you know, sort of, they didn't let me sleep very much. <laughs> I often like to feel that I'm addressing the audience. Not necessarily directly, but certainly, um, you know, sort of, I, I, I do develop with, with the audience, you know, right and, and, and so on, with the audience in mind, because, because it is for them, you know, so, and it's just, it's just great fun. Right, okay, the story is very good. 